Today we got our delivery of the Matos Pixels. Uh, these are the new Evos. So let's take a look what comes in the box. A little packing sheet we took out. There's a message they ran out of the cool boxes for shipping. So we got some Evos. Uh, it looks like our our 50 counts are sitting alone. But that will give us the easy ability to look at what the Evo pixel looks like. So you can see the small pixel in there, they're native 12 volt. We got the Matos logo on the back. Like I think everyone else has mentioned and we've seen before, the wiring is, is much smaller than your normal pixels um, that we've been using in the, the bullet form. Um, but because they're native 12 volt, they have much uh, lower power draw. And so there's less current and so there's less need for uh, thick wire. So then we go through there. It's normal with Matos, we got nice boxes for everything. And we have our pixels. Um, they're kind of bunched up in there, but they are tied just like your normal ones. They just look like bunches, so that's what a 200 strand looks like here. And then down here, we got the 100 count. So same look, one bunch. It's got your standard X connect ends on it. And so now we get to put them to work and we got uh, some coro props uh, from a couple different vendors to put them into and we're also going to do some testing to see how they do in terms of uh, current and voltage drop across the stringing them up um, we got 1500 total and so we might go ahead and do a test and put all those on one port and see see what happens um, we know that's not realistic for a show but we may check it out just to see how they perform. Yeah, we got a few boxes of 100. And quite a few boxes of 200. And I do have them planned for some larger props. So I figured less connections would be easier to go ahead and put together. So here we have our first prop that we're going to use our Evo Pixels in. This is the new EFL snow globe. I picked it up at Christmas Expo this year, so the convenience of that is I didn't pay shipping. And also it's not a slit prot, so everything is one solid piece of coro, no need to put any backers in it. Um, and then on the back of the EFL props, he now is generally including the wiring diagram. So it makes it a lot easier when you're pushing the pixels to know already in what order you need to go. And here we have the globe completed with the 750 EVO pixels. Right now I have it split across three ports at 250 pixels each. So enjoy looking at some different effects shown on the globe.